For special types of polygons, we look at three special types. The first is an equilateral polygon. And this is a polygon where all sides are congruent. So if we have a shape and all sides are marked as congruent, then that shape is equilateral. Now we can either get the congruency dashes or the sh sides can be given a length, such as 7. And if all sides have that same length, then it is also equilateral. An equiangular polygon is a polygon where all angles are congruent. So if we have a shape and the angles are given the same congruency mark or they're given the same angle measure, we know that our polygon is equiangular. If we have a polygon and this polygon is considered regular, if sides are congruent and angles are congruent. So if we have both the conditions above, we have what is called a regular polygon. Okay, based on those definitions, identify the following polygons as equilateral, equiangular, regular, or none of the above. Take a moment to do so, pause your video, start the video again when you're ready to see the solutions. Okay, for the quadrilateral, we see that we have four right angles, which makes this shape equiangular. We, however, have a side that is 20 and another side that is 10. So the shape is not equilateral, which means we classify the quadrilateral simply as equiangular. For this quadrilateral, we have congruent sides, so equilateral, but notice the angles have different congruency marks, so it is not equiangular. For the pentagon, all the sides have a measure of 10, so it is equiangular. All the angles have the same congruency arc, so it, I'm sorry, the sides told us that it was equi equilateral. All the angles have the con same congruency mark, so that is why the shape is equiangular. Since we have both, that means that this shape, it can actually be classified as regular. For the L shape, we see we have right angles here, but this is not a right angle. So the shape is not equiangular. We also can see visually that the sides are not congruent. So this shape is none of the above. It is not equiangular, it is not equilateral, and so it cannot possibly be regular. For the triangle, if this angle is 60 and this angle is 60, we know the sum of the angles of a triangle is 180, which means your remaining angle must be 60 degrees, which means we have equal angles. The shape is equiangular. Also, we have congruency marks on all three sides. The shape is equilateral. Both of those characteristics means that our shape is regular. Lastly, let's look at the cross. We have right angles in these corners, but these angles here are not right. So our shape is not equiangular. But let's look at the sides. Every side is given a length of 7. The shape is equilateral. Hopefully you got all those right. If so, congratulations. If not, review the video again. This is the final video for polygons.